today I'm going to be doing lip swatches on the new ColourPop Ultra Matte Liquid Lipsticks. I wait. 25 shades. I'm going to be swatching all 25 shades. So, if you guys want to know how they look, continue watching. Hey beautiful, so today I'm going to be doing the swatches of the ColourPop Ultra Matte Lipsticks and I have all 25 shades. I tried so hard not to look over there. So I'm going to be swatching all 25, let me just grab a grip full. There's so many beautiful colors, I'm just like, <gasps> because uh, I love a liquid lipstick, especially matte. I feel like matte lipsticks are just like, ooh, right now. So I'm going to go through them quickly and I'm going to swatch them every single one so the lips are going to be burning. So I'm going to go through every single one and then at the end of the video, I'm going to give you guys my final thoughts and what I think about the formula and the lasting power. So I am going to give you guys my final thoughts and the lasting power because I did wear Trap when I was away. I wore it the three, two days that I was there and I got a good chance to see how long it lasts in the formula and all of that. So. Let's just get onto the swatches and let's just get this thing rolling. Let's start. like some milk chocolate milk chocolate that's been huh? looks like uh uh strawberry chocolate milk like if I just kiss like if I just kiss the chalkboard or something
that straight up looks like dog poop. Like. Can I rock it? Can I rock the kakika color? It looks straight up gaka gaka. <laughs> so here it is. cracked in the middle oh I keep I'm using this Elizabeth um, eight hour lip uh, lip cream it's good for your lips it's been helping taking off the lipsticks but oh by the way like it's cracked in there like <laughs> you guys see that it's cracked like look at my lips look all shriveled up but last one so this one is zipper Woo. You know I had to save the purple for last. There's like two purples, right, in this collection? Like three, like a lavender, purple, and then like a deep purple. <gasps> yes. <sighs> okay, so those are all the swatches. I hope you guys enjoyed them. Oh, Lord. 25 that was a lot I use an old like um, blanket and like I swatch my lips on this look at this look at this like ooh, that was a lot um so for the review part there was a few of them that I liked and a few that I didn't like there was some that just glided on like booter and then there was other ones where it's like it was it took a lot to cake on for it to not look patchy um, I think down below I will put like a star or something of the ones that I like the most. Um, but the lasting power was pretty good. I wore trap when I was away and I wore it every single day. It held up pretty freaking good. The only thing that kind of bugged me was that when I was drinking or eating, the inside right here would kind of get like flaky and like fl flick, fl flake off. So I had all this lined perfectly, but in here it just it looked like a butthole, okay? It just looked like I was missing, so I had to keep retouching. So if you're gonna go out for a few hours, like I would say like three, five, six hours, take it with you so that you can do touch-ups because it will come off. Um, with lip gloss, if you put lip gloss on top of it or like anything, anything on top of it, it's gonna come off and it's that's it. So don't think like, oh, I'm going to put a gloss on it, it's going to make it look better. No boo, it's going to come off easier. Um, just how I was just doing the swatches, I had to put a cream on because my lips were cracking and it just came off so quickly. It's really easy to take off, but it does last pretty well if you're not drinking or anything or eating. If you're just chilling, you know, with your makeup on and you're just trying to look fab, then you're good. You don't got to do any retouches. But if you're going to be eating, drinking, you know, all of that which I do because I love food, then you're going to have it missing in the... It's going to be missing in these areas right here. The outside would look good, but inside your like inside your lips right here, it's, you're going to need to touch up. There was, like I said, some um, hits and misses. Um, patchiness, sometimes I'd have to just let it dry for a little bit. It dries really quick, so you don't got to wait that long, and then just go over it again, and it's going to look okay. What else? Um, the formula is really liquidly... The formula is really liquidly, 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 so it's really easy to like move around your lips. Um, with me, I didn't have any problems with applying it, but with the lighter shades, some of them just looked a little bit too ashy on me. You guys can see, in the, you guys can see in the videos, but I think with a brown um, lip liner or mauve lip liner, you can definitely pull it off. The lip liners that I recommend would um, be the Avon Mystery Mauve and NYC a bit, a bit, Taupe. Those would be really good to use with the lighter shades because a little, the lighter shades look a little bit too uh, on me because. I am brown biscuit, so if I go in with a lip liner, like a taupe color or a mauve color, it'll be fine. It would look really pretty, I think. But other than that, in my opinion, I think they are awesome. There's enough shades for you to pick, you know, 
just one or a few. You don't have to get all of them. But there's enough shades for everybody to be like, yeah, yeah, I can get a color that I like. They're really pretty. I really like how they're in the glass tube. Pretty. And I like how it has color pop right here. I like things that sparkle. And this is just enough. It is so pretty. So I would have to give this a thumbs up. There's really no complaints where I'm like, oh, it's really shitty. You know, it's six bucks. And it, it, it holds up pretty good. When I was out there and if I wasn't drinking or like um, eating or anything, it stayed put no problem at all. But as soon as I started eating and drinking, the inner started disappearing, which is fine. Six bucks, just put it in your purse and reapply. It's no biggie. You know, just as long as you keep it with you, you're going to be good. So... Other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed these swatches. Let me know down below what you guys think, which ones were your favorite. And if you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And stay tuned for more videos. See you guys in my next video. Bye.